ladies and gentlemen, you know, I've done stories on Jackie Johnson and how long they're taking to get around to her case. And this story actually flew under the radar and I came across it today, actually looking for other things. So the last time the case was delayed, Ahmaud Aubrey's father responded and he said, all of these delays and Jackie Johnson's case is deliberate. But I think we all know this, you know, she was a DA. So she's got to be familiar with the judges and the prosecutors and everything down there in Georgia. And they really don't want to go after her, y'all. But they're going to have to because she was so deeply involved in trying to cover for the McMichaels and, you know, all the multiple phone calls. So it's really no way around. But since they really can't get her out of the whole thing, they're delaying it as long as possible. So let's get into it. Ahmaud Arbery's father claims case against former DA is deliberately delayed. The father of Ahmaud Arbery is demanding action in the case of the former Georgia prosecutor accused of trying to cover up his son's murder. Jackie Johnson served as the top prosecutor for coastal Glen County when white men in pickup trucks chased and killed Ahmaud Arbery after they spotted the young black man running in their neighborhood just outside of Port City of Brunswick on February 23rd, 2020. One of Johnson's former employees, Greg McMichael, initiated the fatal pursuit and his adult son, Travis. He fired the gunshot blast that left 25-year-old Aubrey dead in the streets. A neighbor, William Roddy Bryan joined the chase and recorded a cell phone video of the killing. And, you know, they actually thought that was going to exonerate them. It just goes to show you how clueless these folks are. They'll film themselves murdering a man that really was no threat. Ahmaud Aubrey was no threat in that neighborhood and thought showing that murder was going to vindicate them. Wow. But I guess if you got privilege, perhaps that's the way you think. So more than two months passed before the McMichaels and Brian were arrested on murder charges in Aubrey's case. Yes, and I remember that. Travis McMichael was crying like a little girl when they finally got around to arresting them. I, I believe, you know, this happened in February and they did not even get around to arresting them until May. So we know what happened after Brian's graphic video was leaked online and the Georgia Bureau of Investigation took over the case from local police. Yeah, because Jackie Johnson told the police not to arrest them. So that's why local police didn't do anything. The grand jury indicted Johnson in connection with Aubrey's death in September 2021. She was charged with felony count of violating her oath of office and hindering a law enforcement investigation, a misdemeanor. The indictment alleges that Johnson used her office to try to protect the McMichaels and told Glen County police officers the day of the shooting that they should not arrest Travis McMichael. Johnson has denied wrongdoing, saying she immediately recused herself from the case involving Aubrey's death because Greg McMichael had worked for her as an investigator. You know, he was an investigator, but he didn't have sense enough to know that Ahmad was just jogging in the neighborhood and he's an investigator. He, he, the way he went after Ahmad Aubrey, he got to be the dumbest investigator in America. So anyway, her defense attorneys 
filed a legal motion in March last year asking the judge to dismiss the case. And of course, they did not dismiss the case. And I did the um, video on that. In recent interview, Action News Jax, Aubrey's father, Marcus Aubrey, said that Johnson should be held accountable and he believes her trial is deliberately being delayed. Yeah, I believe that too. Her case has seemingly been in limbo since 2021. Yes, they have been making every excuse to delay her case, y'all. Now, we're going in to year four. They've been delaying her case since 2021. And this is 2024. Boy, you can't tell me this ain't privilege. It most certainly is. Her last court appearance was in December of 2022, where she waived her appearance. You are not above the law, Aubrey said. You will come to justice. Officials with the Georgia Attorney General's office told Action News Jax it will continue prosecuting the former DA attorney. So right now, they literally do not have a scheduled date for Jackie Johnson's hearing. Privilege is real, y'all. It is real. And this case is definitely the epitome of that. Mm -mm -mm. So I will be on the lookout if they happen to do her trial in 2024. They have really gone above and beyond to keep this woman free when she doesn't deserve to be free at all. Jackie Johnson needs to be in jail. She is a criminal that took advantage of her top job as prosecutor to cover up a murder on the behalf of her friends and people she favored. She needs to go to jail. So y'all, please tell me what you think about this video. Please leave your comment and subscribe. Don't forget to hit on the notification bell and I'll see you on the next video. Peace, family. <music>